So for our geotechnical investigation, we're going to likely be sending a drilling rig out to a job site so that we can get samples of the soil and make some determinations here in the laboratory. We'll be getting our samples back in a ring version like this. They'll come in these tubes and we'll extrude them in the laboratory and prepare them for different tests. Today we're going to be preparing a consolidation test to be able to determine if in the field if the existing soil as is is exposed to moisture or to a load if it will if it will consolidate sometimes you guys kind of a delicate test we have to make sure that the ring that we do extrude out of this is undisturbed and as it's found in nature so that we can get the data that's relevant for the engineer. All right, so we're finished preparing our ring for our consolidation. We're gonna take that over to our console rack. We're gonna set it up and put it under a load. Here we have our prepared consolidation that we obtained from our ring samples that came from our drill rig. We're gonna set it on a stone. Oftentimes on these consolidations, they'll wanna have a swell ran with it. So we'll load these rings with a proposed weights and see how much that soil collapses. And sometimes an engineer after a certain amount of collapse will want to see what happens if you, if you add water to see if there's a swell potential under a certain load. So we have it as it was out in nature in this ring right here. And we're going to subject this soil to different loads and see how its behavior is. We've already taken a weight on this we know the volume of that ring. We've been able to determine the in-place density, in-situ density, if you will, out in the field as well. So we've set our rings on it. We're gonna get it set to balance for us. All right, so we've got our ring set into the uh, consolidometer and we're going ahead and put a seating load. This is just a light load for let a little bit of kind of just the natural movement to, to stop happening. It's just a little preset load. And then after a time period, we'll come back and we'll add um, the actual load that's prescribed by the engineer. So we're going to add a little bit of a load to this. Loads will all be predetermined by the engineer on how much consolidation they want to observe or at what different rates that they want to observe it. And that's going to show us that material compact as this weight is borne down on the, on the ring that we have here. All right, we've let our sample rest for a little bit with some of the different loads that have been prescribed for the test on this one. We're adding another load. Right now it is compressed. 0.01 inches, that's 1% of its original height. So at this load currently that we have on it, it's continuing to consolidate. And we're gonna continue going based on what the engineers prescribed for this test. We're gonna allow it to do this until we've gone through all the series of weights that's been prescribed. And then we'll see what the consolidation is. The engineer will interpret that.